In the heart of the ongoing conflict in Gaza, the two largest hospitals, Al Shifa and Al Quds, are now non operational, amplifying the humanitarian crisis in the region. International media reports said that non stop Israeli raids have forced Al Shifa and Al Quds, the primary healthcare lifelines for Gazans, to shut their doors. Al Shifa Hospital, in particular, is under siege with Israeli snipers targeting anyone in proximity, effectively trapping thousands inside. Ted Rose, Director General of the World Health Organization, paints a dire picture emphasizing a perilous situation in Gaza's hospital. Tragically, more patients, including premature babies, are succumbing to the worsening conditions. Constant gunfire and bombings have exacerbated the critical circumstances rendering Al-Shifa not functional as a hospital anymore. As the crisis unfolds, the Israeli military asserts its readiness to evacuate vulnerable newborns from Al-Shifa to another hospital. However, Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has rejected calls for a ceasefire until all hostages captured by Hamas are released. The Israeli PM contends that Israel attempted to deliver fuel to Al-Shifa hospital but was refused.